Hey guys, I just wanted to let you know I've got a new doubles course on the website. Check the description box and we're having a huge sale coming up. So look for that. I've got 13 courses that can help you take your game to another level. Today's lesson is on topspin, how to hit it with power and consistency. I'm gonna talk about something that many players do not fully understand. There's different types of topspin. Now, we all know that topspin means that you're making the ball spin forward, okay? You're, you're brushing the ball. You're starting below the ball on the backswing. You're coming up to hit the ball with a vertical racket face. So your strings brush up on the ball as you drive through the shot. That imparts that forward spin. Once you get that forward spin, the air pressure is now pushing the ball down. A great thing to have in the toolbox. But there's, we're gonna to talk today about three different types of top spin. Okay, the first one, the defensive top spin or the tactical top spin, where you're trying to hit a high loopy shot. Um, let's say your opponent does not like high backhands. You're trying to hit a high top spin loopy shot. that's gonna bounce up high to him. Or you're on defense and the ball's coming quick and you're just doing the Nadal, just trying to get it back, maybe cross court deep or high and deep. Now that swing pattern is going to be, you're gonna be low and you're coming up sharp, okay? Now, if you were using it tactically, you might be going forward and up, but the, the swing pattern is gonna be a lot more low to high. So you're swinging up on a sharper angle. That's the number one, the high loopy stuff. Now let's say you're trying, you're in a rally, you get an opportunity to hit a winner or to hit a real aggressive shot, maybe force an error or a weak reply. So now you're not gonna drop the racket as low. You're up, you know, you, you're always lower than the ball because that's the only way you can get topspin. So you're, you're coming down below the ball, but you're driving through the ball more, okay? So it's more, here's the low point, let's say. I'm still below the ball and I'm coming up, boom, and I drive through it. I'm finishing high, but not that high. Not like the loopy stuff. That's when you're going for that aggressive outright winner. And then you have one other one. Let's say your opponent is coming to the net and you wanna dip one at their feet, okay? You're just trying to get it over the net, dip it at their feet. Or you wanna hit a little short angle. The only way to hit short angles is to use spin, top spin. So you're gonna dip it into the court before it goes wide, okay? So that type of swing, you're gonna actually use the wrist this way, and we know about the windshield wiper, right? The windshield wiper motion, where you're going like this. Okay, so I'm coming down below the ball. I'm coming up, and right here, I'm gonna flick that wrist up. I'm not gonna flick the wrist like this. I'm not trying to come over the ball. I'm flicking up. The windshield wiper has such force that the racket will come back down. Okay, so it's like here, there, and back down here. That's when you wanna hit that dipper. So let me show you those shots. So the first one, if I'm hitting that loopy one, I'm just, you know, coming up, and I'm really trying to loop it, and, you know, you can 
step into it slightly, or you could do the Nadal, you know, especially on defense. One where you're back here and you're coming up. Okay, so that's topspin. You're brushing the ball, but you're doing it on a real sharp angle. But you're still using the spin to pull the ball back down in the court. Okay, the next one, <clears throat> you see an opening, you're in a rally, and you want to nail one. So you're here, and now you're not going as low, and your swing is more uh, horizontal, okay? Your swing, it's not so much of a, an exaggerated low to high, you're more like this. So now, stepping in here, Okay, you can see how that ball was much more of a drive. And then the last one, the dipper, I'm really trying to use that wrist to flick up and come back down. My goal is to bring that ball back down before the service line. There we go. There we go. There we go. So you can see on that shot, the finish is low, and I'm using that windshield wiper much, much more. I'm using that even on the drive, the windshield wiper motion comes into play. And if I turn and I'm trying to hit that loopy stuff, I can still use that windshield wiper, but it's much more exaggerated when you're trying to dip it at your opponent's feet. Okay, here's a side view of the, of the loopy stuff. You see how I'm coming up. Here's a side view of the drive where I'm going for the power and I'm being aggressive. And here's a side view of the dipper. See how that rocket is really coming down. I hope you enjoyed that video. Remember, there's different types of topspin. Know the swing pattern that you need for each type. We talked about three today, the high loopy, the drive, and the dipper, okay? So knowing that swing pattern and working on it is gonna help your game tremendously. Just get out and drop hit balls like that. It's going to help or work with a ball machine or a friend or a pro, and you're gonna see, you'll start to understand topspin better and you'll understand how to get the power and the consistency that you want. So please give this video a like, a thumbs up, and uh, please subscribe to the channel. I'm here to help you take your game to another level. That's what I do best. <laughs> All the best, guys. Take care.